Prior to the prior to the establishment of the Chalukyan power in Badami area, there existed a Rashtrakuta power, and with the establishment of Chalukyan power, the Rashtrakuta power had disappeared. We do not have enough evidence to establish the relationship between the Rashtrakutas of Manyakita and the earlier Rashtrakuta families of southern Maharashtra or Vidarbha or Badami. Rashtrakutas proclaimed themselves as rulers of Lataluru and it is identified with Latur presently situated in Osmanabad district of Marathwada. Rashtrakutas were a Kshatriya community of Andhra Pradesh, while some other historians identify them with Reddy community. Several Chalukyan epigraphs of Eastern Deccan refer to the term Rashtrakuta Pramukhanam, who are identified as agriculturists of Andhra Pradesh. We come to know from Undikavtika copper plate of Rashtrakuta Abhimanyu that there existed a Rashtrakuta kingdom in southern Maharashtra with Manapura or Manyapura as its capital. Inscription number 67 Undikavatika copper plates of Abhimanyu Probably belonging to 6th century AD for the probable date of this inscription and the history of the early Rashtrakutas of Manapura, see D.C. Sirkar, History and Culture of the Indian People, Volume 3, The Classical Age, pages 199 to 201, Fleet assigned this inscription on paleographical grounds to approximately the 7th century A.D. Provenance not known. Script Brahmi Late Southern class of 6th to 7th century AD Language Sanskrit English translation of the inscription Om He There was a king called Manenka who was the crest ornament of the Rashtrakutas who were famous and adorned with many qualities. He had a son named Devaraja who was, as it were, the king of gods, Indra, in human body. Since other kings, swallowing their pride, had tied their own banners of fame to his lofty lineage, the banner of Devraja's fame was visible yonder or from his city for a long time. And is so every day like the holy water of the Ganga in spate to him, who had conquered his enemies, were born three sons who had won the group of three objects of human existence and who having conquered their arrogant foes, annexed their ample royal splendor along with their territories. Zero of them, Bhavishya had a son Abhimanyu, who is like Abhimanyu in heroism, vigor and beauty. By him, while adorning the city of Manapura by residing there, has been granted with libation of water the hamlet named Undikavtika to the ascetic Jatabhara for the temple of Dakshina Siva of I located in the city of Pithapangaraka for the increase of sources of religious merit of his mother and father. Towards this grant nobody should practice deceit. The grant has been made in the presence of Jayasinha the commander of the fort of Harivatsakota. Here follow two of the customary verses. Kindly note that Petha mentioned in the inscription stands for a market town. The temple of Dakshinasiva of Petha Pangarka has been identified in the Bombay Gazetteer with the Mahadev temple near Pagra which is nearly 6 kilometers from Pachmarhi.